friends it's saturday this is take two because it was the first time i tried to shoot this video it was like nine minutes long and that is unnecessary <laughs> but i still want to do it in one take you know so barely millennials episode one assault and battery is live and the response was weak <laughs> to say the least because it always is uh i expect it at this point honestly i expect no one to watch things and then when they do i am pleasantly surprised and so with that in mind i was still discouraged yesterday when i had chosen and uh, like a, a, a time for the video to go live that I knew would be more likely to fall into people's free time. That's why it went live at 4 p.m. on a Friday. Because then I knew that the weekend would start very soon after that for a lot of people. And for the people who are my age, who for sure aren't working on the weekend and don't have kids, I was like, yeah, there's some time there. Doesn't matter. What happens will happen. <laughs> it's the first episode. It's not like it's a standalone thing. I think that's what I have to remember is that there will be more episodes. And if people decide eventually that they actually want to follow this journey that we are starting, they can do that. It's not like it's going away. So I need to keep reminding myself that. With all of that being said, there was one response, one actual like comment from someone. And it came from my cousin who never really comments on my video work. And I don't expect it from her. She doesn't really like people posting on YouTube. She thinks it's a waste of time, whatever. And it is a waste of time. And I enjoy it, so I will keep doing it. <laughs> but she's she, she has every right to think whatever she wants. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it just came out funny. I'm sorry. She said that she started watching the video because we are her cousins and she loves us and she stayed because it was worth her time because it was funny and because she genuinely was <laughs> she genuinely was wanting to w see what happens next in the video and so she stuck she stuck with it the 27 minutes whatever and she told me that she's excited to see what the next episode brings. Which is fuel for the fire that I need to shoot the next episode and edit the next episode, upload the next episode. Which is hopefully going to happen soon because I think the more I can do this, the better. But there was just something about that specific response that meant so much. I think it was a combination of it being someone who I don't normally hear from when I post videos. And it being someone who has always been supportive of the not good videos that we made when we were in high school. Like she mentioned the John Soko Productions videos that she always thought were funny. They were funny to us, but not really to anybody else. And she was one of the people who actually thought those videos were funny. One of the very few people who found them funny. And so that investment was what brought her to the video in the first place. And it's also what's keeping her there is because it's the same humor. We have the same humor now as 20, mid 20 somethings. <laughs> 
as we did when we were like 16. And that's a little embarrassing, but also not surprising. I think the difference is that I am a much better editor than I was then. I'm also a much better cinematographer than I was then. So it's what the kids call a glow up, I would say. And I hate myself for saying that because that's such a stupid phrase. But it's actually accurate in this case, I think. And so because of that, Because of that, I am so excited for the tripod that I finally ordered on Amazon to arrive sometime this weekend, because then we can shoot another episode. And I don't remember if I was going to say anything else or not, because I just, I'm thinking too much about the glow up and regretting that I said it, but also knowing that it's accurate. So we're going to end it there. This is still a long video. It's still significantly shorter than the first one that I tried to shoot. Yeah, if you haven't watched the episode, go watch it, because it's actually funny and great. And I'm not just saying that. Uh, I can now say someone else told me that.